1023 is our time right now. We have some breaking news. We want to get to our Bob Barnard. He is live on the scene at Washington Liberty High School uh, where they've had an unnerving morning uh, lockdown situation and they're figuring out what's going on. Bob, what can you tell us? Yeah, Holly, uh, this school here in Arlington County has been dismissed for the day. Show you the school behind us. It's still kind of being protected by Arlington County police after a threatening call was made uh, this morning to the school. Uh, they evac It was before classes started. They evacuated the school. Now, a couple hours later, they've sent everybody home. We've had parents picking up kids, uh, some school buses deployed as well. Class is canceled. Uh, Frank Bellavia is with Arlington County Schools. Frank, thanks for being with us. Tell us about the situation. Uh, good morning. It was an anonymous call, I guess. Yeah, just before school started this morning, around 8 a.m., we got a phone call, an anonymous phone call, um, that there was an active shooter in the building. So the school system or the school immediately called the police and uh, evacuated the building. Um, from that point on, any students that arrived or staff that arrived, we moved them to a safe location so that the police can conduct a search of the building. Why the decision to send everybody home? You know, we didn't know how long it was going to take to uh, clear the building, so um, we made the decision rather than to keep kids out here to send them home so at least they were uncomfortable because this was um, a traumatic experience for them coming in the first thing in the morning and finding out that there was this call made to their school. So rather than keeping them outside, we, we sent them home. And we've seen waves of kids leaving here. Fortunately, mm -hmm. so far nothing's been found, no active shooter or anything. I guess the school has not been released or cleared yet, but uh, you know, so you don't want to uh, take this lightly, but for a lot of kids, hundreds of kids, it's been a very disruptive day. Yeah, it has, it has, and that's one of the main reason why we sent kids home is because it has been disruptive. And um, we, you know, we dismissed our walkers, we got buses here to take kids home so they can go home with their families, and, and we'll have counselors and staff on standby when school does return. So if they do have um, issues or concerns, that they can at least address them with a, with a counselor or, or school psychologist. Frank Bellevue with the school. We take a look across the street here. This is another student here leaving across the street. Uh, you know, we've seen individuals and groups leaving, going with parents and what have you. And, you know, guys, there are no school resource officers any longer in Arlington County. We've had others tell us perhaps if there was a school resource officer here, this thing could have been diffused, perhaps handled a little differently without everyone having to go home. Uh, that's uh, for another day to uh, to think about and, and to uh, explore. But uh, that's the status here in Arlington County. Washington Liberty High School uh, dismissed for the day. Good day at 9A, at 10A. We'll be right back.